What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. It's your boy Terabyte Reacts here back with some more Sons of Anarchy. Yes, this series is awesome. You already know how I feel about it. I don't need to go through that again. But man, Jax is becoming a savage. <laughs> you know, he was already savage. But now he's becoming more of a savage. As I said, I wouldn't do that to my own moms, but yeah, you know I'm saying Gemma did kind of bring it on to herself by, you know, what I'm saying driving while she high. She made a mistake. Yeah, you know I'm saying. And I'm not saying that she doesn't deserve to be forgiven. She definitely don't deserve to be around her grandkids anymore. It's going to take a while before that passes. You know what I'm saying? Like she spiraled out of control and it spilled out into, you know, almost them losing Abel and, and, and freaking Thomas. So <laughs> what, do you, what do you think is going to happen now? You know what I'm saying? Now she's, Jax is telling her, listen, I need the ins and outs of what Clay's doing. And you're the one that's going to get me that intel. So I'm going to need you to suck his D. I need you to F him. I, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it's kind of weird because people are saying that, you know, he's whoring out his mother or whatever he's gonna be pimping his mom but she put herself in that position you know what i'm saying she put herself in that position because she could have easily said she could have easily said tara i can't do it i'm sorry i can't do it um you know um i'm high you know what i mean like she could have reasoned with them but because she thought she could handle it and this is the dilemma she's in now. And I'm not saying that what Jax is telling her to do is right. You know what I'm saying? It's not right. That's your mom's, no matter what she does, still your mom. You know what I'm saying? So to that level of disrespect is uh, is not needed. It's unnecessary. It's unwarranted. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Might like Jax a little bit less because of this, but at the end of the day, both you know what i'm saying Gemma is to blame has to take most of the blame in this situation because she put herself in this position but in any case guys you already know what to do hit that like button let's go watch this reaction and then you come back for the review all right so let's go do that All right, well, let's talk about these two episodes. These two episodes are very grounded episodes, of course. Um, not too much. Um, you know, when it comes on to... The progression of the story was was good. Progression there. You know, people finding out about what people know, other people find out what people know, all this other stuff, and, and all this stuff that's going on i think the, the thing that i really want to talk about is situation that happened with otto and tara and the thing about it is i was worried about this happening because you should have never done that <laughs> she just should have never done it she should have said no something else you know what i'm saying let's do something else you know what i'm saying that no you know what i'm saying and he take he took advantage of her in, of her innocence you know what i'm saying to bring him that crucifix um and i was like why are you leaving him in the, he's a cr you don't do that you saw how much i started to panic once he said can you leave the room for a couple of minutes i'm like this dude is up to something you cannot leave a prisoner like that with a weapon like that. I was like, this guy has something planned. I don't know what it is. I know he's, you know, he's cuffed or whatever. He's restrained. But I still don't trust him. And the minute I say, the minute he pressed the button, I was like, ah, oh, she, here we go. They're going to come in here, release him some way. He's going to request that he get one of her hands released or something. He's he going to go, dude. He made her an accessory to murder to hurt Jax. I wasn't even thinking thinking of it in that way. 
I wasn't even thinking of it in that way because I, I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wasn't thinking, I was thinking he just did that to, um, not to hurt Tara or Jax, but I thought he was doing it to recant the testimony because now that he's committed another murder, there's no way they're going to take this guy serious in court. You know what I'm saying? Like, the deal is off. You know what I'm saying? The deal is off. You're supposed to stay out of trouble and all that stuff so your testimony can make sense. But now that he's committed another murder while, you know, this thing is going on, his testimony gets thrown out. Like, a part of the deal is for him to not do anything like this. <laughs> you know? So, um, I wasn't even thinking that it could hurt Jax or... I knew that it was going to... that there was going to be some repercussion, you know, and some, some overall hurt for Tara, you know what I'm saying? As in her being a witness to it and also, um, her bringing the crucifix to her that she was going to get in trouble because of that. But I wasn't even thinking, oh, accessory to murder. You know what I'm saying? Because once they find out who her husband is, you know what I'm saying? They're going to say they orchestrated this whole thing for for the, for him to get out testimony and all of this other stuff. So I don't know how this is going to play out. Um, Clay seems like he's turned a new leaf. He's found out about the CIA's involvement. Of course, he's not going to tell anybody at the table that he found out. Um, you know, we got Juice's secret coming out. There's a lot of stuff. There's a lot, a lot of conjecture and, and and secrets coming out into the open people revealing stuff to one another jack's finding out a lot of stuff clay is still on the chopping block juice has a spy on him now and as i said i have completely in disagreement when it comes on to to what's happening with Gemma. you get what i'm saying you don't send the woman back to her abuser you just don't do that. And it makes it even worse that that's his mother. You know what I'm saying? Like, I get it. You don't want him to be around your kids, but you should have never put her back into Clay's hands. You know what I'm saying? Um, but, hey, she's taking it head on, you know, and I give her props for that because the most people would have probably took the other choice. Yeah, you know I'm saying, and to give her an ultimatum like that, like I said, I don't agree with it because you just you, you you don't do that. I get what she did was, you know, what I'm saying was completely wrong. You know, what I'm saying, and you know, I, I didn't, I wasn't in agreement with it because even I was trying to find an excuse to say that can't be it. You know, I think Gemma is just a better person, and she's above that. She loves family. She's all about that. And she makes, you know, she makes good decisions. So I could never have imagined I was still in doubt because I was like, she wasn't high, right? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was thinking that she was high during that situation because I was like, there's no way Gemma could be high and driving those kids. Like, I thought maybe, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, she, you know, heart hacked enough. Maybe she had a mild heart attack or that's what I was thinking. You know, I could have never imagined that it turns out that she was actually high. You know what I'm saying? Because I said maybe enough time has passed, you know, for her to come down. Because we did see her smoking weed, you know. But it's just of who the character is that I've give, given her the benefit of the doubt, but not anymore. I can't give her the benefit of the doubt. But at the same time, you just don't do that. It's still your mom. Still your mother. You know what I'm saying? So, at the end of the day, man, this series is 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 going on and on and on right now, and I, I and I'm loving it. I'm loving it, man. But in any case, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in once again. Thank you guys. Please leave a like on the video, and of course, leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think of these two episodes, of course. And I will catch you guys later. Peace.